Hello Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I hope you're all having an amazing day today. I'm going to be taking a look and seeing what's manifesting for you all, what's going on right now in your current situation with you, the person on your mind, if any, and what you need to know. So whenever you do see this, it will be the right time. As always, take what resonates and leave out the rest. Practice using your own discernment. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, follow me on all social media, TikTok, Instagram. I am Spiritually Goldie on all platforms. And if you are interested in a personal reading, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you all. Okay. So, it feels like things are starting to finally balance themselves out here. Temperance, peace, harmony, and honesty. I'm seeing a, a, a relationship forming that is built on trust and built on honesty. And this is also a reflection of the relationship with yourself. I can't always expect the truth from others, but I can expect it from myself. So being honest with yourself, with, with what you really want. Is this what you really want? Um, is this someone who you really want as a partner? Is this home what you really want is this destination um, that you're going in is this what you really want for yourself so introspection reflecting on yourself your intuition sitting with your emotions feeling and trusting the way that you feel about a situation Ooh, king and queen of cups here yeah you definitely have a very beautiful relationship forming here Something is going to work itself out, Leo. More than what you imagined. And there is work that it has to, that is like needing to be done. I mean, we always have work to do. But this is mainly with yourself. Like your, your self-esteem, your self-security. I possess gifts of the soul that benefit me and others, knowing that you are just as special as someone else. You are just as valuable as someone else. We are all different. And there is a, this huge realization of what was I even worried about? <laughs> Why did I even let this? You were a queen and you were worried about a page. <laughs> right and now you're realizing but I mean it's like we all it's not about being better than someone else it's about realizing we are all special we are all uh we all have different gifts and we are all on different journeys and we are all learning things on different levels we're all growing at a different pace but it feels like there is a situation right now that you are I mean there's someone who you deeply deeply care about or love it's like you know you love this person but you're worried to uh, or you're afraid to to lose this person because of how much you you care about them but there is um the ending of this worry the ending of allowing your your fears or thoughts that are not true create this narrative of of fear and worry and lack yeah that's that's ending now you are a part of you is dying and being reborn to receive this love to receive this this relationship built on trust Okay, forward movement, fast forward movement. Things are about to move very, very quickly here. 
something is about to take off very, very soon. Sooner than you expected. Okay. Stress. Okay. Someone around you has been afraid of losing you. Stressed. Lost their sense of control. Okay. All right. So someone feels like they have lost their sense of control here. They know you're what they really want. And they are starting to feel strong and powerful emotions for you. I'm hearing that they haven't felt for a while. They haven't felt these emotions for a while. Maybe even years is what I'm hearing. But you, you did something. <laughs> you did something, Leo. Okay. So let's take a look at this person. I'm seeing strong Sagittarius. We have Leo Aries and also Pisces Cancer Scorpio here. So let's take a look at this person. Think of the person on your mind. Justice, balance. They're looking at this situation like, like there is a decision needed to be made. Balance. It's interesting with the star though, it feels like this person is hopeful. They feel hopeful for the future with you. A hopeful that things are gonna work itself out. But I do feel like this person also feels like um, they're struggling, struggling with something. There may have been a like a disagreement or a little fight or something like that of some sort or jealousy even from this person triggered. I'm definitely feeling like triggered, but but they don't want to let you go. So they really want to hold on to you. They're seeing you as a hanged man. So you may have uh, held back at some point and this has worried them. They're seeing you as being open or starting to open up emotionally but they want to bring balance to this and security to this um relationship with you they want this to keep growing mm, interesting all right yeah so it, i definitely feel like this person knows that there's things that they need to work on because they they've been deeply hurt and so they they have the tendency to close themselves off but now they're feeling certain emotions strong emotions with you here that they haven't felt in a very long time success but they want to fight for this um, perseverance they're not going to give up this person does not want to give up they don't feel this person wants to keep pushing for um, for this for a relationship um, ten of cups and the four of wands celebration taking those next steps commitment settling down pushback is what I'm hearing I do feel like there's a little bit of pushback currently um, but there is perseverance and there is love. I just, I just see this working itself out. Ten of cups, four of wands. I, you're, you're going to be really happy with the outcome and feeling very grateful. Gratitude. Um. I am thankful for this life and the opportunities that it presents. There's an opportunity presenting itself to you that could turn out to last as a long-term relationship. Um, but somebody is working on their self-esteem right now. This is something that is being worked on and healed. Anything else? Pride. 
And also, love for yourself, pride. I love myself and I see myself in everyone. Love. Love with yourself is also showing up. Love for yourself is also allowing others to love you in return and releasing any guilt from the past. Okay. Ten of Cups. Feels like things are, are about to move forward the right way. Looking back, seeing why was I worried in the first place. Feels like there is some sort of unfinished business. But there is some sort of next step being taken. It's like someone is being redirected back here. It's like, where do you think you're going? That's <laughs> what I'm hearing. Okay. Yeah. I, I see... I do see... Someone wanting, like, no one else other than you. Ooh, the lover is at the bottom. This is your next relationship. And it looks like a pretty serious one. This is someone who you could have a family with, have kids with, settle down with. There, four of Wands, this is a gathering. You could be moving in with this person, taking those next steps. This is someone who I see you with for a very long time. I feel like there's not much to say other than that. This is just a beautiful love reading. I'm seeing the numbers 14, 5, 10, and 4. Those numbers, they could be significant for some of you. I'm seeing the letters H, B, W, R, S, E, and G. Those letters could be in your name or someone else's name. But with that said, this is what I'm seeing. If it did resonate, let me know. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. I hope you all have an amazing and blessed rest of your day. Bye.